Shouldn't miss an opportunity to get one in. It's a short favorite of mine, beautiful waterfall. It rained this morning. Rockstall Nature Preserve. Glad to be showing you all this one. Not too much to see at the beginning. There's the path. So I'll probably check in at the stairs unless I see some pretty flowers or something. All right, talk to you in a little bit. Okay, quick note. This is the quick way to the rock stalls. This is the way to the steps. I highly recommend going straight just because it's easier going down this way than up. And you see the waterfall more towards the end. Kind of like the view coming through the gorge to the waterfall instead of waterfall then work your way out. I've gone both ways, so take my recommendation or don't, but we're going my way today. So this is really our first view of the gorge, not quite to the steps yet. You can see that rope down there, but uh, you can already hear the water flowing, so it's got me pretty excited. Might even be some additional side waterfalls. If we're lucky, so heading down it where I just came from, where I'm headed. Here, the smacking water that's exciting. This is something I am going to check out today, too, after doing my normal hike. Some kind of trail, it's been uh, getting more established over the last couple of years. So I've been actually been on it, it used to be very thin. And it looks not so thin now. So maybe have some bonus ridge top views, but do the typical loop first. And I'll check back in down at the bottom. We got somebody buzzing around me. Some pretty trillium. I'll work my way down the stairs. Nice wildflowers. And that is a separate waterfall. Because the main one is pretty far back. Bonus views. See the end of the stairs. And our buzzy friend is back. First views of the sanctuary. See two of the falls. Hey, the majority of the times I've been here is in the winter. I come here because it's actually really green with ferns and a lot of moss. Just when you want to see some green. So, it's a lot thicker than I'm used to. Quite beautiful though. I'm loving the spring vibes this year. So you gotta find a way across the creek. This looks like the best one. And then we'll go check these out. And see where that water's falling. Climbed up top of this first little rock area. See, there's a nice cave back there. Fun to play around on. Now head to that waterfall. To the end of the trilliums. Still blooming. We'll work our way along the main path. The falls are back this way, the main falls, but I want to hear what's going on up there. So I'm gonna head around there and see if we can get a view of this little waterfall. That's something. All right, head back to the main trail. Heading along the trail. Very peaceful. Views these gorgeous rocks. Very green and lush. You can hear the waterfall in the distance. We head that way. There's the main trail to the falls. 
But before you get there, if you go off to the right and cross this creek, it's a fun cave. Big enough to walk into. I get over this. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's really cool with all the ferns hanging off of it. Oh, okay. I don't know if that was pulling last time I was here because I remember walking in here before, so. <laughs> Proceed with caution. Yeah, it looks like some fresh falls. Hmm. How much do you think those weigh? And landscaping. And my answer is a lot. So, maybe not in the cave, but you can look at it. And go back over towards the waterfall. There it is, our first view of the falls. They're flowing all right, not the heaviest I've seen. I've seen them both going pretty good before. Still quite beautiful. Really, it's a short walk too. You gotta be able to do some uh, up and down, especially to get out, because that's the way out. But, Quite worth it. There's another extra waterfall over there. Flowing today too. And it's the Rock Stall Sanctuary. That is a beautiful short hike. I got it to myself today, so take some time, sit on a log, maybe do some yoga, and uh, I'll check back with you on the way out. Start where we finished on the way out. So that clear water. See right through it. Hop over these logs. There's a waterfall. I don't get a good view of that one. We're up here. Get over the creek. It's like right there is a good spot. Double creek crossing. Boom. Boom. <laughs> Oops, excuse me. So one of the challenging parts. I mean, not for a good hiker. Go up this. It's not really marked as a trail either. Figure out through all trails originally. Get up here. The route you want. Slippery rock. And get to this pretty little thing. I'll take a moment here too. Trail leads out that way, and then I'll check back in at those steps. Last view of the gorge from down below, till we get to these steps. I feel like you should be forewarned. I mean, I can get up and pretty easy, but. Yeah, great balance or not the best hiker. <clears throat> Something to know about. You can take the steps out too the other way. Oh, we got lots of water on it. All right, so to the top. Normal way out that way. But there's that new trail that I already see that goes this way. So I'm going to do that today and see if it has anything special for us. And I will check back in. As you can see behind me, I made it to the steps. So, not really much to tell about this trail. Can look at it. Mm -hmm. It doesn't really get close enough. I mean, maybe right here to the gorge. Get any amazing views plus there's a lot of trees in the way um they probably don't want you going over there anyway safety liability so other than getting in extra steps you could do a different style loop and skip the high trail up there just come down this one i mean obviously you don't want to skip the gorge trail i wouldn't think you would but yep 
just have to do steps. I don't know. It's here. I mean, this looks cool. But like I said, when I try to look from the edge, there's not much to see because of all the hemlocks. So. Nice nature walk. Can you hear the waterfall? Cross a log. And check back in. Back on the main trail. Cute, medium, little waterfall. Same stream that leads to that side waterfall on the gorge. And we start heading up and out. been a pretty walk out stream crossings and flowers and frogs <laughs> that's cool sorry to disturb you fellas I guess there's gonna be ladies too sorry Okay, I'm just gonna enjoy my walk out. Check back in towards the end. I'm gonna close it out with this one, but uh, see behind me. It's getting a little warm now because Rockstall reminds you a nice lesson. What goes down must come up. So, regardless of the trail you take, you still gotta go uphill. I just think the way I recommend is a little better. I've done the other way and the stairs were brutal. This is a gradual uphill, so you can feel it across a few logs. So, thanks again for watching. Uh, yeah, get better at posting, but definitely been recording. And um, I hope it gets you encouraged to get out there and hike. I love it, it helps me. So many other things in life, mentally, physically, it's a good thing to do. So, work my way up through the mud, some little flying birdies over there, and see you on the next one.